Internet and Melly. This is Casey, 25 and 52. The second conversation I had today was about Star Trek. The first one was about religious education. Today, I introduced myself to a class full of people, beginning with, I'm like Che Guevara with bling on, I'm complex. I think until I said that in that context, I didn't quite get why I couldn't get those lyrics out of my head. And dealing right now, I think, with this feeling of not knowing how to be correct. I think it's something about a new place, but some of it is also about, you know, really being on this path now instead of just saying that I am. Um, and there's something complicated about fitting all the pieces of me together. They don't always feel like they go. Some stuff is intellectual and deep, and some stuff is not. I really like bright colors, and that's not intellectual or deep, I just like bright colors. But I also think too deeply about most things, as you know. I dislike what uh, late-stage capitalism, if you will, has done to our society, but I like to buy stuff. I have serious thoughts about a lot of things, but I also really like a party. I'm a Berkeley liberal, progressive lefty, with a heart that was built in conservative Ohio. It doesn't always feel like it goes. It doesn't always feel like it should be possible to be all of the things that I am at once. I feel like somewhere I must be doing something wrong because I'm not doing things in a way that is, you know, linear or makes sense. But nobody does. Nobody makes a lot of sense, right? The only people who make sense are fake. You know, there's not one story about anybody's life. There are many of them. That's something that we actually ran into a bit uh, during introductions in my Tuesday class last week. Uh, we were introducing ourselves and we were told to tell why we were there. Like, why are you in seminary? Why we were there? And you know, we got through a few people and then took a break, and I was talking with one of my classmates who I was in orientation with, so we already knew each other, and it was really hard for both of us to find, like, what is the one story? And, you know, I wrote all of that application stuff that is about what is the story, but the fact is that there are a bunch of stories. I became who I am in a bunch of ways, and all of those pieces of disjointed and maybe not what you'd expect are the things that came together to make me who I am. So maybe I'm full of contradictions and maybe that's okay, and maybe everybody's kind of full of contradictions. And I know that that's probably, like, a thing that is known, right? Like, there are probably people who have thought about this before, but there's something, for me, important about realizing it in myself. Um, about thinking of all the ways in which I don't think I make sense, and then the ways in which that kind of layering of differing aspects makes me me and gives me some of the insight that I have and things like that. Um, so that's kind of, you know, where I'm at. And it was really, really interesting, I think, today particularly because I have these gigantic earrings on, not that they were expensive, and I have eyeshadow on. And I've been a lot lately really like 
performing the femininity. Um, lots of like cute outfits and make sure that you've got the makeup on and that stuff. And I actually said today that I wore eyeshadow because I don't have any nail polish on and this outfit isn't interesting. Um, and that's, that's interesting to me that I'm, I'm performing something and I'm not entirely clear on what exactly is happening there. But it was funny to say the words and then feel my earrings jingle and think that's maybe more true than I thought it was. Um, and you know, you think it's just this throwaway line that it's not about anything, but apparently it kind of is. So that's weirdly a combination of everything that I've learned in the past week. I love you, and I'm excited that you're coming to visit, and I hope that people around here will be around to meet you because I think that you will like them and they will like you. And I have a paper to write and a thing to read. I have a... on my wall. You see that? Yeah. Bringing it back. Bringing back the stuff on the walls thing. Um, but I have the stuff on the walls thing, so I have reading to do, and I have a paper to write, and some other stuff. It doesn't matter. I'm on top. I got this. Bye.